Hello friends, welcome to my channel, a channel for learning simple coding. If you find this video to be helpful, please like, share and subscribe my channel. In this video, we are going to resolve an error that comes in React. What is the error and how we can solve? Let's see in this video. If I try to run this application, npm start. So it will run without any problem. If we have package.json file, remember that this application is running without any problem. You see it running, no problem. So I close it and I close this one also. Now suppose intentionally or accidentally I delete this package.json file or my package.json file is corrupted. Now if I start npm start then I will have this error you see npm error enoent no such file and directory means this package.json file is not found because by intentionally or by accidentally we have lost this file we have deleted this file we have modified this file. Now it is not possible to recover this file because it has been deleted. And it's not a node.js package.json file, so we can recover by npm in it. It is React application that cannot be recovered. So first of all, you have to take backup of this package.json file. Otherwise, we have a one solution that may work on your application also. So you have to test yourself. So what is the way to resolve this error? First of all, just come out from this directory. Now create one more React application. So we say React, create React app, and I say change name. It's a change name, just any name you can give. Previous application name is testing that package.json file has been deleted. Now I'm creating change name. Any name we can give, name doesn't matter. It will create a new JSON application. Now you see this is this application has been created. So we do not have to start this. So we again go to testing application, the application where we have deleted the package.json file. So here in testing, we have to create a new file. We say package.json. So new file we have created here. Now go to change name, open package.json file here, control A, copy, close this and paste the data of this change name to your testing.json file. Now in place of this change name, give the name testing because the directory name is testing, means the package name is testing. So we have changed the name, we have created a new one, remember that if your react application have some other dependencies like this dependency I have so you may manually add this dependency here if you required so install it manually otherwise install again those dependencies which you want to add remember you can install again if you will install automatically will add otherwise manually you can add your dependencies if you lacking any dependencies in a newly created JSON file but this is the only way to recover this file save it now file is ready again we just give npm start and you will see that this application will run again because we lost the package.json file now we recovered it from a newly created package now we are, we are able to run this application again so that error has been removed you see application running without any problem that means the error is gone that's all in this video. If you like it, please do subscribe. Thank you for watching this video.